Hey, this is Lewis from SoFly. In this video, I want to show you how to use JavaScript inside of Oxygen. So if you have JavaScript code, you can either add a code block and go to the JavaScript tab and then just write your JavaScript code. Or you can add JavaScript code to the JavaScript tab of any element. So let's say I want to add some JavaScript to this button. I'll just go to Advanced, JavaScript, and now I can add JavaScript to the button. Now, when writing JavaScript in Oxygen, you're probably going to commonly want to use jQuery. Now, you don't use the dollar sign for jQuery. You use actually jQuery because that's how it works in WordPress. And Oxygen works the same way. So let's make a jQuery effect where when we click this button, it's going to add the class uh, Neon to this heading right here. So what we're going to do is jQuery. Um, we want to select the button. So that's the element that we're currently editing here. So what we can do is we could actually type in the element name, for example, like that. But you can also just use percent percent element ID percent percent. Let's expand the editor again. And that will be replaced on the fly with the actual elements ID. We also need to use the uh, pound sign there because it doesn't actually include the number sign. So one note about using jQuery with Oxygen or writing JavaScript in general with Oxygen. Whenever you click apply code um, or close the box, it's going to apply the code and that's actually going to create a duplicate copy of the code. So the more you edit the code, the more you end up with a million duplicate copies of the code. That's just the way Oxygen works. It doesn't work that way on the front end. It just works that way when you're actually creating the code in Oxygen. So Let's say we add a click event here. Well, this click event is going to fire a million times. So we don't want to do that. So what we're going to do is go jQuery um, element ID off click. It's going to disable the click event. And then we're going to actually put our code in. So that means every time we apply this code, it's going to first get rid of the old code the old click event and then reapply the new code. So that's what we want to do. Um, let's expand the editor again. So when the element is clicked, let me go function and then we are going to go uh, jQuery, whatever that heading is, we will add an ID later, toggle class, neon. Let's go ahead and get the ID of that heading. Paste that in. Uh, apply the code. And now whenever we click this button, it will toggle the neon class. Okay, that is how to use JavaScript and jQuery in Oxygen.